everybody! Game of Death Shows back for the queue! Episode of Beach Beat Splash! Yay! I feel slightly. So the guy's now. taking over? <laughs> <laughs> no, I was just doing it for a moment because literally, uh, this uh, Paradise episode we're doing is literally about being trying to act uh, cute, quiet, adorable. Oh! Okay. That's why, that is why I was trying to do a bit of a cute opening for that one. <laughs> Believe I'm a little embarrassed to the two. I was say, is this about <laughs> Yumi? Uh, it involves Yumi and Murakumo. Of course. <laughs> it's the end that Murakumo that which I find absolutely adorable, but um. Yumi tries a lot on being, uh, trying to be cute. And she's having trouble right now finding a partner to compete in the, uh, Summer Fest. So she also finds a partner that can do just as good as she can on being adorable. So mm -hmm. we're gonna try... Day. So we're gonna try Haruka first and see how that goes. But first, I'm gonna, of course, make some... Switches on my uh, cards here to uh, hopefully work out, work a little better. Don't ask about that Ikaruga card there. That was a little weird, but uh, why not? Oh yeah, I was playing some of rural life today. I'm playing on hard mode. So far, it's freaking easy. Well, yeah, because you got all the strong spirits and everything, so of course you're going to have it super easy. Oh my god. Ikaru, well, yeah. I do have to say, though, why you got the honey there on blocking the particular parts of the area? It's a little weird, yeah, because but, when uh, you start a new game fresh, um, your spirits would carry you over. Oh, yeah. That is true. It makes uh, most of your battles pretty much uh, a lot easier. Okay, now we're all set. So let's go, um, find us a partner. <laughs> yes, I, you did not oh, read that wrong. Super. Cute and What did it say? It says cute and justice. In a cute okay. way. Okay. Anyway, Supergirl was on. Let me watch that, that later. Orca. <laughs> well, okay. I mean, not the whole thing is about being cute, but that's uh, Yumi's idea to do for Summerfest. Um, well, I might have found what Haruka was going to do, but uh, I took her a little too quickly. Sorry, Haruka. <laughs> On the fence. <laughs> I swear it sounded like she said pudding. <laughs> it did kind of say it sounded like she said that. Nipple. Nipple pudding. Alright, I forgot to mention about those packs. Um, If it's ever one star, you're always going to get pets no matter what. Oh, hello. How late am I? Uh, you're about like four yeah. minutes late to the Peach Peach Splash video. Yeah. I but, uh... Uh, you want to jump in about five minutes in and we can queue you in. Alright. And I just got my setup, so... Gotcha. Alright. Now, Frank Katsuragi and I, yummy. You said four minutes in, right? Five minutes in, yeah. Alrighty. So, 30 seconds left, and we'll be ready for you. Oh, we'll say something I forgot. God damn it. Damn it. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> Cat belongs to you, huh, Yami? I see. Uh, uh five, four, three, two, one, go. 
Splash. And down goes Yami. The particular pet she was also using was uh, to make her invisible. So that's why I have trouble finding her first. It's <laughs> it's <awful dumb. laughs> who, who got a PlayStation 5 in is doing Astro's Playroom? BSO. I am. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> we're, we're about to actually finish up uh, the next time we record, which is uh, tomorrow. <laughs> okay. Um, I am streaming. I Oh, I did beat Kingdom Hearts last night, so... Oh, which one? The first one. Okay. Awesome. Nice. Although I'm about to go back and fight the super bosses. Oh yeah, have fun with those, especially several. I already, I already defeated one of the super bosses. Which one? Uh, Kurt Ziza. Oh yeah, the one that was saying after a real life person because he won something. Yeah, yeah. that boss. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. Damn it. They um, kind of did the same thing in Kingdom Hearts 3, in a way. I haven't even been in Kingdom Hearts 3. I'm still playing through it. I hate to yeah. say it, but I still yet to play it. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh. I told my yeah, friends that just I'm gonna... with the DLC. I told my friends I'm going through all the games, so that means I have to go through Chain of Memories. I have to go through all the bad games, too. Like, Chain of Memories and... Recoded if recoded is a playful game. I wish 358 over 2 was playable. That was one of my favorites on the DS. Fuck. <sighs> Damn you, grunts. My knees, my knee hurts so bad, especially my right knee. Damn. Damn, Damn it, that doji, it's over. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, sorry I've been away for so long. Was yeah, that's fine. Yeah, fine. And when I moved, I didn't even have my, like, I had a laptop I could use, but I did not have my setup. Uh, yeah. I understand. Also, Daidoji, uh, you got a lot of work to do on being cute. Sorry. It's a good try, but uh, you need more practice. You do not have the strength to be cute. <laughs> True companion test is next. And we're against Hikage. And the Samba Samba is going to return. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I think there is a pair of this episode involving Hikage's uh, uh, emotions acting up again and all. We'll, we will be seeing that later on in uh, these parts. It's actually a little funny watching that one, how she reacts at, at differently throughout the uh, five missions. <laughs> Where's going, Kage? Hi there. Yeah, that, still that one scene in Shinobi Versus where she takes one of her potions. Oh, yeah, yeah. Get the whole samba samba going on. <laughs> I think, um. Shoot. Ah, I forgot her name already. Minori. She was messing with her, um. Haruka's potions, I think, and everyone's acting funny too during that. There it is, speaking of which. <laughs> Fortunately, that's all we get. Sorry, Kake. Well, you're on the water, see so yes. No. Yeah, probably not your best bet, Yumi, but good try. Alright. One more to go. And now we're going to take on uh, Murakumo. It's more the cutscene after this, that's what makes it funny. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of makes Murakumo more adorable, too, at the same time. <laughs> oh, yeah, you heard about the whole uh, Bowser suing Bowser recently? 
Uh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, Gary Pallister. Yeah. Something about uh, legal Nintendo hacks and shit like that. <laughs> Objection! Yeah, this is going cool. after people named Pallister. <laughs> oh, yeah, apparently Square Enix has announced to make it eat. 3 2021. Hope it's worth it. Hmm. Come on, Mara, come on. You can join in. Help, help you me out. <laughs> I can. Not like that. Not that kind of help. Yeah, that's not helping her out. <laughs> no, you're not. I'm oh, well, that did it. Oh yeah, the guy you heard about Last of Us getting a remake. Yeah, which I think is stupid. It is. The, the first game is not even that old. Not even the remastered. <laughs> oh, and and, and yeah, the remastered version came out a year later. They said something about um, I think it was the president of Sony in America. Saying yeah. that no one plays retro games. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was the reason why they just want to shut the PS3 down, but they changed their mind about that, like, yesterday. Oh, yeah. But the PSP is still going to shut down. Yeah, I was watching, I was watching uh, some ordinary gamer did a, did a video about that, and I'm like, <laughs> there's a lot of people that play retro games. Yep. Come on, Mark, come on, you got this. I feel like horrible. you're Tekken 3 again on PS3. That's the best be, one out of the PS1 game. Be cute. They only Show put the Tekken 1 and 2 on PS3. They didn't even put Tekken 3. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, a little more. You can do it, Mark. I'm on no pressure here. A little more. <laughs> Wake this. What is this? Let's try and help uh, Mark be uh, cute. Not too shy of being under her mask. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, of course. <laughs> well, to be fair, it is 2021, so she got it with her mask. I'm sure I didn't include that bit, you know. Yeah. Yeah, you're not wrong, though, but... Yeah. I'm not, I'm not trying to think about, you know, COVID at the moment. Yeah, same. Some of that shit to go away. Well. But yeah. yeah. Anyway, though. Yeah. Uh, Ayami's business is next. And we got four to work with. We got Ayami, Mirai, Super Teen Girl Shiki, and um, Murakumo. Super Teen Girl Shiki. The best she turned 16. I'm only calling it late because BSL kept saying it off as a late. <laughs> <laughs> They're, uh,. Ayami's running out of ideas on uh, what to do here. She wants to um, start selling some different things here. Besides just, you know, bras, paintings, and other stuff here. Of course. What about my girl Katsuragi, though? I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, actually, funny that Katsuragi is going to be kind of part of this uh, story in this bit here in this episode. Really? You'll see why at the end of it. <laughs> well. All I gotta say is, what the fuck? <laughs> that random Easter Island head on the bookcase. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just because why not? The Hi, Murakumo. <laughs> also, that poor baby made there. It kind of looks kind of sad, the position it's in. <laughs> oh, it's in the air, too. Never mind. And it looks like the Hebrews rabbit is about to attack. 
just how it's positioned just seems a little odd. See, see, you guys. You know the uh, Yuffie DLC is coming out in two two months. Yeah, but only for PS5. I know. Now, and I want to play it so bad, but no. <laughs> Square Ace, Square Ace, pretty much saying fuck the PS4 owners. Let's put on the PS5 and milk the franchise. Yeah, they're literally milking the franchise because they were making Final Fantasy VII to get. Well, <laughs> and guess what's gonna be on? The five. Android. <laughs> well, oh, I um, went, um, are you talking about like First Soldier? Something like that. <laughs> oh, that's that's a battle royale shooter. I was hoping for V two to be on PS three, but when they mentioned on PS four, like okay, I gotta start saving for PS four then. Th yep. Worked down the end though, so paid off. Looks like history's repeating itself. Me won the Yuffie DLC. <laughs> yeah, but for me, uh, I. Yeah, it's no fit for me. <laughs> you lucky. Yep. I am. Alright. So, we gotta go fight some grunts, so let's go ahead and do that. I think after that, you know, we just pretty much fight up uh, the characters afterwards. This took a bit because I actually had a little trouble trying to find where some of them went to. Where are you guys? There you are. There. No, you're up there. Okay. Up. Hmm. Yeah, I think I know what I was going to say a little earlier. I, I was going to. Oh, I'm like halfway done. I was saying, uh, Smash Ultimate. <laughs> yeah, I got. I'm not. I'm here to stop and doing that. Yeah, I, I got. I need two more achievements, and I I gotta get the rest of the spirits, which is gonna take a decade to do. <laughs> well, probably not a decade, but shoot, tell it to the Korok season, bro, for the wild. He's just exaggerating. I'm only missing <laughs> four. I'm missing like literally four spirits. And for achievements, uh, about like another tw uh, 25, 26. Wow. But I'm not really bothered with it, honestly. Yeah. And I still work my way to 103, where my main file. I try to use both controllers, but, but something's wrong with my, my, uh, my Joy-Con, my original Switch controller. I'm glad I don't fuck with that controller no more. Yeah, it's just a Joy-Cons too for these Mission 3. So that's why I got the, <laughs> I got the Pro Controller to help me finish up the game then. Yeah, I'm still my Pro Controller. I, I originally brought it just for that one pop move mission in Mario Odyssey, but I am using it now. Oh. She made Christmas. I spent a lot of grunts for me, but they're all done. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not sure Cat Cutter was nearby. Hmm. But I'm sure she's got faith in you. Oh, Sprout and Girl. Okay, we're fighting Yomi next. If it has to do anything with Sprouts, it's it's Yomi for sure. Hmm. Ay, ay, ay. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> I think it's in top about the moment. Yeah, I'm just drawing a big here. flat. I'm drawing a big flat blank at the moment. Defeat Yomi. Yep, that's uh, pretty much it. And four of us oh, against yeah. her. That's pretty easy. Yes, yeah, I started watching Spider-Man: Homecoming. Pretty good movie. I believe you. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Give me a second, she's blushed. <laughs> Sorry, Yomi. Yeah, That's what kind of star you can play to write? You probably don't want to. Fan fiction? You know what? No, Yomi. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> you probably yeah, don't that was know. fast. Over the line. We had our four of us against one, so yes. It, now, we're, now we're gonna face uh, Minori next. Minori. These Paradise episodes usually go by pretty fast. That's why if I'm... If lucky enough, I'm trying to at least get two done at once. So you can speed through this a little faster. Yeah, they still talk about the whole George Floyd thing that happened a year ago. Okay. Yeah. Defeat... Minori. Oh my god, for a, se for a second I thought it said defeat Moon. I also made the fucking Moon reference from the <laughs> SA2 fan dub. Okay. Thank you for that. Oh. That shame it. Well, that was quick. Yeah, I got, got a limited water, uh, water ammo now. <laughs> if they strain me enough. With the, with the guns. With the guns. Or if anybody gets any weird ideas. Damn it! Minori! <laughs> I was trying to go, I was trying to go on a windless, uh, try to deathless streak here, you took out my life. <laughs> a windless. <laughs> I, I'm oh, wait. Not windless. Um, if it was windless, then I'd be trying to lose every time. Okay, now, I frame, now I frame what I was going to ask you. You, you you're, oh, you heard that Jake Paul one the other day? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I, I saw, but the thing is, like, he was he was up against, like, an actual MMA fighter who's, like, kind of old. Yeah. And the thing is, like, when it comes to boxing and MMA in general, when you're an MMA fighter into boxing, you limit yourself into what you can do. Yeah. So, so... Sorry, I'm just like crumbling up the bag. Um, but yeah, it's like the MMA fighter, like he could have done if he was in the octagon in the cage, he could have done whatever he wanted. But when you're in the ring, or boxer shorts, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he was. When you're, he in was... The, when you're in the ring, um, when you're in the boxing ring, you can only throw your hands. You can only use boxing, so that limits yeah. yourself. Uh, but yes, like, even... Okay. Oh, I was like, going to say, like, for me, because I know Muay Thai, I have some boxing, but because... Yeah. If I'm in the if I'm in the boxing ring, I'm still limiting myself because I can't throw kicks, I can't throw knees, and I can't throw elbows. I can only throw punches. Huh. Alright. Even though I so... am trained to learn boxing as well. But right, that's still a that's still limitation on my part. Uh, that's what I'm saying. Alright, so what's going on in this mission now? What's with her box shorts? I was just gonna say, he was the only one that wears boxer shorts under a skirt. Compared to everybody oh. else. And she's not the only other one I know that wears them. Uh, Misaka Mikoto from Scientific Railgun, uh, also wears boxer shorts under, uh, her skirt too. If you don't show your underwear, then you won't the team. Well, I wanna show my underwear. I guess I'm afraid they, uh, that you can wear underwear over uh, boxer shorts in there instead. Hey, if you just come to wear boxer shorts, that's fine with me. Yeah. World of intimacy. Now we get to face Katsuraki. Last but certainly not least. It's just after we get finished with the, the fight here is where King. My oh boy, it gets a little nuts. <laughs> my way, the world intimacy. So I'm guessing this is part of the trophy run, isn't it? You gotta beat those um, side stories. Night. Uh, not sure how to answer that. Yeah, because I still I still didn't play on this game. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Uh, 
I don't know the Paradise episodes completion is part of the trophy. I mean, these are easy, but you get more uh, car packs to work with. Uh, actually, let me go look and check now. Yeah, I think you found this game. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know what every I don't know everything of it though. Yeah. Hands on. Damn! What the hell was he gonna hit by? Uh, final chapter. No, nothing about doing the Paradise episodes, but it gives you new oh, pack okay. cards to get, though. Okay. It was a uh, fast one, too. I told you, Square, it's 4 on 1. What do you expect? It's gonna go by quick. <laughs> and, guard pick. Oh, hello. She, I think, could be like a story on uh, her and Katsuragi. Oh, if you a fan fiction, uh, hashtag cast Rocky X, uh, what's her face? <laughs> Kyria or Mr. K is not happy about it. Oh, yeah, I knew it's a fan fiction. This is rated 18 and up. <laughs> he's, he's, he got a nosebleed. <laughs> and he really literally destroyed all of them. All the copies are gone. Well, lucky for somehow, uh, Ayame, uh, kept it burned to her memory. Somehow, some way. This is why I write stuff on the computer. It saved it. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> you should have added the freaking field of Eagles in the fear fiction. <laughs> oh. No. You want to do that? Do it yourself, then. <laughs> Anyway, ignoring that, uh, shit. <laughs> uh, go buy some stuff at the shop real quick and then we'll call it an episode. And yeah, that for, per for perfection, we'll be doing that next time. With, uh, Soji and Homura. Hello, Dio. My waifu. <laughs> uh, by the waifu. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's uh, the, uh, the shop lady. Well, you didn't have anybody work the shop besides Ayame. Oh my, Murakumo. <laughs> That's all I gotta say to that. Oh. Thank you for your patronage. Patronage, yes. <laughs> Ever heard that in Lord Kai? Uh, oh, sorry. <laughs> Too much. I have right there. I'm at 5,000. Uh, nothing. More commons. More commons. Dash damn it. One more. Yay! Some more rares. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> bye bye, waifu. Bye bye. Anyway. Oh god, doesn't <laughs> yeah. she freaking kill you instantly because you didn't buy her stuff? <laughs> or you stole something? No, it'll be more like, uh, I'm thinking from Skyward Sword, you know, buy anything from Beatles. Drops the trap door on you and you fall out of it. <laughs> yeah. That's actually more funnier. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> so next time we're gonna um go help perfect Soji. She's aiming for perfection against Homura, so that's what we're gonna do next. But we all know folks perfection never exists. But until then though, later folks. Later. Later.